there are two stories associated with today's hymn on spiritual conflict. Uh, stand up, stand up for Jesus, you soldiers of the cross. It was written uh, for or by uh, a Presbyterian minister in the 19th century called George Duffield. And it was inspired by uh, the death of a young Presbyterian minister, uh, a, a young age in 1854, who had taken a lot of abuse in his stand against uh, slavery, which was, of course, one of the great spiritual battles um, of his day. And uh, as this young man was dying, uh, the words he said were, tell them to stand up for Jesus and let us sing a hymn. And uh, it was those words that uh, really gripped George Duffield and uh, he understood when he heard them, the young man to be saying, standing up for Jesus was standing up against the uh, slavery of their day, which was, of course, a tremendous uh, social issue. It was also a tremendous spiritual issue. And again, those who were seeking to uh, um, overturn that uh, were wrestling not with flesh and blood, but principalities and powers. Uh, so that was the battle of their day. And it makes me think, well, what are the battles of our day? What are we to stand up for Jesus in? And uh, I know in evangelical circles I grew up in, this would have been a, a popular hymn, but uh, it you can sort of sing rallying militant hymns, but not actually be in a battle or fighting a battle. Uh, the second story is that the tune to this is not my tune. It's a, a traditional rebel tune in Northern Ireland associated with uh, the fight against the British. And, uh, but it goes well to this, uh, uh, this hymn and it's a stirring tune. And I remember one time when we were singing this in uh, uh, a church I was involved in, there was a, a member of the congregation who'd come in and he had a background that was total opposite of the nationalist background. It was a very loyalist background. And uh, of course, when he heard this uh, Republican tune to a Christian hymn, he had a very, very strong reaction. He could almost, in fact, I think maybe he did refuse to sing the hymn because of the association with the tune. So that's the two stories. And uh, I suppose the challenge here is really, uh, what is the trumpet call uh, going out today, calling us to as his people? The other thing I like about this, it's about the army. It's about the soldiers, not just the individual. Charles Wesley's great hymn on um, soldiers of Christ is really, really uh, uh, strong in the emphasis of standing together, indissolubly joined to battle all proceed and uh, there's uh, something about being in the battle together uh, that's so important and there's nothing in my experience in the Christian life like fighting spiritual battles with comrades in arms it binds you together uh, it inspires you uh, and it's a, I found personally it was a tremendous defense against personal sin and temptation because you are fighting for a cause and as Wesley was saying you had to leave no unguarded place no weakness of the soul and uh, you were much much more watchful uh, when you had such uh, um, colleagues to be standing with you and uh, having experienced that uh, they, uh, it just reminds me of the longing in my heart to know that again at some point, um, I'm in my 70s now, and uh, my great goal in life now is, as a friend of mine once said, to make a good end uh, whenever or however that may be. And uh, I would love before that end came to just be a part of a praying, battling, wrestling, warfaring uh, uh, a body of Christians that were taking the battle to the enemy and standing up for Jesus today. Stand up, stand up for Jesus, you soldiers of the cross. Lift high his royal banner, for it must not be lost. From victory done to victory, his army he shall lead till 
every foe is vanquished and Christ is Lord indeed. Stand up, stand up for Jesus, the trumpet call obey. Go forward to the conflict in this his glorious day as willing troops now serve him against unnumbered foes your courage rise with danger and strength to strength oppose stand up stand up for Jesus his strength alone. The arm of flesh will fail you, you dare not trust your own. Put on the gospel armor, each piece put on with prayer. Where duty calls or danger, never be absent there. Stand up, stand up for Jesus, the fight will not be long. Today the noise of battle, but soon the victor song. To all the overcomers, the crowns of life shall be. They will 